Here are some innovative ways to create big thinking in the classroom, especially for teachers who are battling space issues. So yes, I do like to make anchor charts with my students and, and I have my anchor chart right there. However, I don't have a big classroom, so I found it very easy to um, put definitions and terms on car stock, colorful car stock, laminate, and then key ring them. It's uh, fast, it's efficient to take down, pack away, durable, so you can have them for next year. As you can see, I have um, um, some different parts of speech, the writing process. I have um, figurative language definitions. Over here I have um, the scientific method. Another tip that I did was I took these strips that I got from the dollar store. There was a dollar a pack. I laminate them and then I had put them on the wall. And when I get new spelling words for the children, I just have to just erase them and then put the new words up. So this is actually a great way for the, word, uh, the kids to see the words throughout the time they're practicing them. Another thing that we did was we are reading Charlie and the Chocolate Factory for my fourth and fifth grade. And I put their vocabulary words like a word wall so they can see it and have a visual. So I put it behind our guided reading section. And again, these are just dollar strips from the um, a pack of dollar strips. And I got them from Dollar Tree. And that's all.